How did they tell you that you're one of the sexiest men alive? Uh, how did they? They sent a, uh, a singing telegram. No, I, um, I don't know. I got a call from my publicist to be honest. You know, it was kind of like, really? What? Really? Okay. Uh, and I didn't quite know what to, what to make of it, but obviously it's very flattering. You know, obviously. It's just, uh, it's kind of odd. It's an odd statement. You wake up in the morning, look at yourself in the mirror, and you're like... I, I wake up in the morning, I got myself a t-shirt, and it says, uh, sec one of the sexiest men alive, and I, you know, and then I put my real clothing over it. It gives me my confidence for the day. It's kind of like you Superman. Know. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? Like Superman. Yeah, it's like Superman. <laughs> you know, no. I, yeah, no, it's good. It's great. I mean, it's flattering, of course, obviously. So, that's really what it comes down to. Excellent. And the shoot? Was it fun to do? Uh, actually, that one was fun because that was in the Hollywood Hills and um, it was so just calm and I don't. I, he just said to hang out in this field and I was just grabbing like a piece of hay or straw or whatever, there's no hay in the Hollywood Hills, but like a little piece of straw put in my mouth, I was just sitting there and, and it just felt, uh, I didn't feel like I was at a shoot, I was just kind of enjoying being in the hills in LA, so it came out well I guess. Great, great. Well, a year ago, a little more than a year ago, I came to the set for the first time. And we're talking about how you compare yourself with Stefan. Yes. And that you relate to him because you also are more of a private person. Uh-huh. I now, tend to be, yeah. there's this whole thing about Twitter. The fans want you on Twitter, right. but... Ah, that's funny. <laughs> you know, <laughs> yeah, I can't... Twitter. Yeah, I just... I don't know what it is. I just can't. I, I, you know, look. Here's here's what I will say. If I ever really need to say something and and I really need to vocalize it to a large amount of people, um, maybe then I will get Twitter. And I there are many things that I obviously want to say, but maybe I'll just save it for something, something really special one day. So they'll have to. So maybe, maybe, maybe there's something coming. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, I can't really find any reason for it. I just, I, I'm very boring. I'm a very boring guy. I have nothing interesting to say on Twitter. I'm sure that's not true, <laughs> but that's why we have this interview. Right, okay. Yeah, there you go.